Oh, damn it. Thanks to Coach V and the other guys over on my team, I got to fulfill that dream. Uh, you know, so that was a lot of fun. I had a good time doing that. Uh, yeah, definitely playing, you know, secret weapon. If we, if we need a safety, if we need low numbers or something, guys getting hurt, I'll happily step into that role. Did you guys talk about that before this? Or, like, did you know that was going to happen? Or you... um, I, I kind of always put it in their ear, uh, always in the coach's ear, just like, all right, I'm, I'm going to get it done. I'm going to some safety. But, uh, you know, definitely today I pushed it once, you know, once the the game was pretty much, you know, uh, decided. I was just like, let me just get this last drive to, to have some fun. Hey, you, come, you, you come back for another year, you deserve to get. Uh, you know, at least a little something, a little benefit. Yeah, 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 definitely, for sure. What uh, what did you make of the way the defense performed? I thought um, we did pretty solid today. Um, you know, I definitely seen some good things, but there's obviously, you know, numerous things that we can work on and do better. Um, you know, but it was just fun to see some of the young guys just play and just cut it loose, you know, got a game setting. Uh, you know, in front of the crowd and everything. Um, speaking of the crowd, you know, we obviously got the best fans in the nation. 55,000 for a spring game is ridiculous. So I definitely want to thank our fans, uh, you know, for putting putting us on, you know, putting it on like a game. We definitely want to see. As a leader on the team, when people kind of talk about the quarterback situation and, and you've got a guy who's a veteran who's led you to the playoff last year, does it... Is it potentially a problem in the locker room if he's not the guy? Or is, is it, or is it within the locker room, guys just want to see whoever's playing the not, a, not at all. It's not a problem at all. Um, you know, uh, you know, just as a leader, you know, it's something you got to monitor. I don't think it'll be an issue at all. We're all guys who, who care for each other and root for each other to do as best as, best as we can. And, you know, we root for everybody to get the job done. And we'll be, we'll, we're behind whoever, you know, whether you're, you know, a right guard, a deep tackle, or safe, it doesn't matter. You know, we're going to be behind you. Uh, if you're on this team, we're, we're going to send you to get the job done. Uh, you know, we're going to root for you. We're going to root for the best guy to get the job done. Are you annoyed that they haven't thrown you into the quarterback competition? I'm definitely, yet? I'm definitely a little frustrated about that. I definitely feel like I got something like a, you know, I got something I can prove there at the quarterback spot. Really, and you're uh, undervaluing your arm strength. Definitely, just the just the arm strength, the accuracy, the ability to run and just make plays with my feet. Uh, I'm not going to go down easy. Uh, so definitely, I'm just pretty frustrated with that. But I mean, I also talk to coaches somewhere and work on my arm and everything. <laughs> Sure. I like it. I like that plan. Thanks, Christian. Any of the, the freshman D linemen stand out to you today? Sorry. Did any of the freshman D linemen stand out? Oh yeah, you? definitely. Um, I'm I'm very uh, like you know I'm very happy with the way these the young guys coming into it. Like it's such a tough it's such a tough thing coming in as a young freshman, you know, and you know you were all this and all that, all world five star, you know. Uh, you know, told you were all world, you know, coming in, uh, you know, out of high school and everything, coming in a position where, you know, you got so many veterans in front of you and guys you got to learn from. Uh, definitely just impressed with how the young D linemen just uh, came in with their approach. They really want to learn from us, learn from all the vets. Uh, they have a great mindset. They come to work every day. And all of those guys really just got better this spring. And it was fun to see guys like KJ get a, get a sack. And, you know, he has a lot of personality, a lot of juice to him. You know, he fits right in with us on the D line. It's just good to see him and have some fun out there. Xavier Thomas, uh, it's just, you know, I mean, those guys are impressive. Good, good, young, uh, active, you know. Uh, DNs and everything, and then the two guys inside. Uh, I got I got the opportunity to play with uh, Darnell a little bit uh, today. And, you know, he's he's gonna come along. He's gonna be great for years to come. And same thing with Josh. He's just a, a man child, and you know, just definitely encouraging all that he, all that he can do and all those guys can do. But I'm just really impressed. Two words that I've heard a lot of people's mom 